Welcome back to Bits Be Trippin'. It's been a few weeks, it's about time for another episode. And with all the feedback that we received on the Gaw Miners episode, we wanted to make sure that we covered another cloud mining solution. So in this episode, episode 21, we will be covering genesismining.com. This is your host, Carter, let's get into this. Now you don't have to go very far on the internet to find that Genesis Mining has had a lot of reviews from a lot of different sources, both from blogs, personal experiences, and a pretty good thread that's on bitcoin.org. You could almost say they're a veteran in the space when you look at the time scale of when cloud mining really started and these guys really pushing the product out there around February 15th of 2014. Now in the scope of cloud mining, that's a pretty long period. So you may be asking yourself, why do I care if they've been around a little longer than any of the other cloud mining solutions? Well, why that matters is purely customer exposure. Anybody in this space obviously realizes that customer interaction, accountability, and delivering on what they promised matters. We look at Butterfly Labs, we look at a lot of the other companies that have failed in this and overwhelming in every case there are large threads and blogs exploiting the facts that the customer service sucks or you're not getting what you're paying for and in the case of Genesis mining here as the review states as the blogs that have been out there have stated as the Bitcoin top.org has stated and from our experience over the past month they are delivering on what they've said they have provided a cloud mining solution that works and offers a hands full of options. So let's go ahead and dive right in to what is Genesis Mining and what are the solutions that they are providing for cloud mining experience. From the webpage, you immediately set up an account, then you purchase your solution. If you're gonna go with Bitcoin or script, you make your selection on type, be it SHA-256 or script, then the amount of hashing power that you want to purchase. Once that's complete, then you go ahead and configure where you want your hashing power pointed to. If we look at our script solution here, and this is a little different than the previous mining reviews that we've done, this actually lets you target specific altcoins and you get paid out in those specific altcoins denomination. And this is a feature that I really want to highlight. Out of all the different cloud mining solutions, this is a phenomenal feature. If you want to target, a, you know, let's say your 100 meg mega hash, like we have a hundred mega hash here. We targeted it to do a spread of different altcoins, not to instantly convert them to Bitcoin. This is a solution and a feature that is healthy for the ecosystem. You're not immediately dumping your altcoins to up convert to Bitcoin, which we've all seen has pulled a lot of the value out of the altcoins because you're immediately just dumping them the moment you get them. This allows you to hold on to your altcoins, hold on to your doge coins or your dark coin and actually Actually be able to spin those separately with the various places that accept Doge and Dark and any of the other alt currencies that are listed here. Those coins will then be paid out to the wallet addresses for the particular alt coin that you have chosen. So I want to make sure this is real clear for the people that are listening to this, that this is your easiest solution to getting into a specific alt coin without having to go purchase your own hardware. You go out there, you choose a gold package, get one mega hash, and then you point that to the specific coin that you want to go. You want to get pot coin, you want to get lotto coin, you want to get something that is in your area that supports the script standard. This is the easiest solution that we have tested to get those specific coins via a cloud mining experience. A lot of the other solutions are great too, but they immediately convert that to BTC. So if you choose a script mining solution, it immediately is converting those script coins that it is mining, the most profitable it switches, and then dishes it out in BTC, which is fine also. But if you want to be part of the ecosystem of the altcoins and help grow and strengthen those networks, this is a solution that provides that ability within a cloud mining environment. But again, as we know, a lot of people are in this for the investment, for the generation of cryptocurrency, mainly Bitcoin. This also provides that solution to up convert those into BTC and provides a very nice display and dashboard of showing you that profitability per day on your payouts. If we just take our use case in general and we look here you can see the spread here over a one month period from essentially September 1st through September 29th the spread and the the value returned from our initial investment of one tera hash and a hundred mega hash of script now when we look at the total revenue generation over the period of September this generated around 600 USD so an individual looking to really expand their portfolio invest in cryptocurrency will want to go more of the most profitable coin but again 
think about the fringe benefits and the utilities of these other altcoins and what they do to the whole category of cryptocurrency. They incite engagement and sometimes that goes a lot further than just dollars and cents. Now in closing, our overall review for Genesis Mining is an absolute A+. We've had no issues over the past month with this. It's paid out as scheduled and it's had that excellent rockstar stability that we all look for. Now let's switch gears and take a look at what's going on next week with Bitsby Trippin and where we're going to be at. We're going to be at Hashers United. Now this conference is taking place in Las Vegas at the Tuscany. It is October 10th and 11th. It's going to be a good time. If you have a chance to get out there and you're really into the crypto mining scene, this is the one that you're going to want to go to. Now we plan putting together a pretty good video for that and then we'll come right into episode 22 which is going to be the deep dive on the mobile wallets. We've been using CoinPocket for a few weeks. We've tried the blockchain wallet and a few other ones both from Android and iOS we wanted to have real experience in this really using it at shops and stores and I think we got some pretty good footage to kind of go through the various trials and tribulations that we've had with using Bitcoin wallets and set those expectations if you're on the fringe of getting a wallet for your your phone I think it'll be a good one hopefully it informs and gets enough people engaged to get out there and get a Bitcoin wallet and finally what should close us out on October into the beginning of November should be an episode on the KNC Titan. I've heard some rumblings that they're starting to ship. We have not got ours yet, but when we do, we will obviously review it and do a very nice deep dive review of that KNC Titan. In closing, I want to make sure I give a good shout out to zapchain.com. This is a Bitcoin social networking site for professionals. If you're involved in Bitcoin, you're part of any facet from venture capitalism to just helping the genre grow the category, any of that. Uh, on a professional level, this you want to join. There are a ton of CEOs, CFOs, CIOs, uh, individuals that are professional in the Bitcoin network that are answering each other's questions, posing questions. Really good site. Uh, a lot of effort had been put into it. Bottom line, don't cheat yourself. Get signed up, listen, and provide answers to some of these questions. And with that, we'll see some of you in Vegas. Stay tuned. Be tripping.